Hello everybody, and this is Best Moss here, and we're continuing back on this. We left off where our kids are probably dead, for all we know. Let's see what people say. You know, it's dangerous to be out at a time like night is a night. That's why I'm telling these two, but they won't listen to me, of course. Where could Klaus and Lucas be? She did say they were coming back today. Wait. Oh, that's right. So I was like, isn't Klaus like backwards? Someone's like, it's like an anagram for Lucas, I think. So where should I be going then? I was like, that's kind of why I stopped at making three episodes yesterday. Then I was like, where am I supposed to be going? Oh, okay then. Flint. So probably head back home and check on things. Alright, thanks for the heads up. So, where exactly is home? Which button is it? This one. Uh, I'm just gonna assume this way. Should be this way. Yeah, that's home. There's a burb. This is like punt it. Oh, it's a letter for Hinawa. We already saw what it said in the last episode. Okay, I guess we're gonna read it again. Dear Flynn, just like you said, they would. Jordan have been running around the mountains and fields, mountains and fields tirelessly since the moment we arrived. Klaus is as daring as full of energy as ever, while Lucas is still a little, a little bit coddled. But neither one seems tired of playing at all. My father seems to say goodbye. Wait, seems sad to say goodbye to his grandchildren, after seeing them for the first time in so long. But we should be home by evening. I had forgotten how nice and refreshing the mountain air is. You're always covered in smell of sheep in Tasmili Village. So I really wish you could have been here to take this take in this air. Next time we visit or yeah, next time we visit, we'll ask one of our neighbors to tend to the sheep so we can all come up as a here as family. Lucas Klaus and I were always thinking about you when we got home this evening. I'll start cooking some of your favorite omelets right away. With love, your dearest Hinawa. All right. Oh, they're still not back. With all this rain, they could catch cold. I'll go find them. They'll probably taking, they're probably taking shelter from the rain somewhere. It's getting late, so we should go back and look for them. We should all go look for them. Let's get to other villages. Let's get, Jesus. Let's get other villagers to help too. Okay, I'll go tell my dad then. All right, I guess we're gonna go out and check. Look at that, there's the mirror thing again. There's Boney. Woof, woof. Please take me with you. I'm sure I'll be helpful. Take Boney with you, of course. All right. Uh, this way. Oh yeah. Good idea to save. Alright. Let's go.
Whoa, where are they off to? Stop you. This is bad, real bad. No one of kids aren't back yet. It's so cool that everyone's like together in this like area. What? Excuse me. Looks like everyone went to the par prayer sanctuary. I really want to help you out. Honest, hick. Well, I'm totally not the guy to help you out. Is he like drunk or something right now? Guess we're gonna have to go into the mountains then. Whoa. It's locked tightly, yeah. Let's go this way. This super tall dude's still here. Oh, we can talk to him. I don't think we can ever talk to this guy. Oh, I had something for a sec. Huh. Weird. Let's go this way. Or why don't we just check our map? That's probably a better idea. I guess we can or either can or can't go this way. I don't know. Let's try like this. Can we ram through it? Okay. Okay. Gotta go left. Alright. Left we go. Oh, there's something on the ground. Open it. Nut bread. There's a lot of nuts in this place. Whoa. Oh, there you are, Flint. I asked everyone to split up to search for us for Hinoa. You've been blessed with kind friends. You must be true. You must wait. That must be true happiness, in one sense. All right, let's go. Whoa, who's this? Urgh, it's cold in the rain. I don't like it. Doesn't seem like ever it's going. It's ever going to stop. All right. Oh, we gotta fight this guy now. Batty blocked the way. Flynn Company earned two. 20 experience points. I need to get better with freaking reading. Like, I need to start reading out loud more or something. I don't know what's up with me. Freaking going to hot springs when it's raining. There we go. Back in the cold rain. That's weird, it's like it's still hot even though it's raining outside. Save the game. Luckily there's a lot of save points everywhere. Oh dang, we did it. Oh cool, bench went up by two, IQ went up by one, speed went up by one, enemy left the present. Inside the present, there was some nut bread. Flint took the nut bread. And let's get this other nut. Oh cool, all the rain put out the fires luckily. I don't know if that's friendly or not, but I'm just gonna assume it's not. Anyone seems to have a good head on her shoulders. Not you though. You're pretty careless, so I bet you forget how to beat antidotes with you into the forest. Despite the fact the place is teeming with mighty bite snakes everywhere, 
Here, you can have my antidotes. If you don't think that'll be enough, you can always get back back. You can always get some more at Isaac's house. Flynn got the antidote. I'm gonna assume it's... Alright, I guess it's a bad guy. Encounter the baked yam monster. Vent an intense burst of steam. Baked yam monster charts. Bam, he's out of here. Flynn, the company earned 42 experience points. Bonus level is now 7. HP 1 by 4. Offense 1 by 2. Defense 1 by 2. But I, I don't know. Alright, let's get out of here. I can assume he's going like a circle sort of pattern. I didn't realize it before because the flames were so intense at the time. But it looks like this area over here got really hit. Got hit by a bad, really... Oh my god. Got hit by fire really bad too. Who is this dude? A fire, then rain, and children smiles. It'll be alright. Reggie knows it. Oh, this guy's name is Reggie. That's cool. Luckily these guys don't move. Run! Oh, present. You know, the president got an antidote. Nice. Let's hurry before Hino. Let's hurry and find Hinoa so she can make us some special omelets. Even though this text is so huge in front of my face, it's like a little bit too close. The forest smells burnt. Well, guess it was a pretty big fire after all. Keep powering through this. Man, we're like blazing fast. Whoa. Another present. I bet it's another antidote. Okay, beef jerky. That's cool too. A present. A mini mini charm. Cool. Let's see what that does. Uh, let's see. Equip. Let's try that. Alright. We've been calling their names for a while. There's been no response at all. You think maybe they're not in this area? Maybe. I don't know. I'm sure Klaus and Lucas will come ra racing before here. Will come racing here before long to have some of those slightly unclean and not very tasty cookies of mine. Oh yeah, that's right. Jeez, they get hit bad here. Actually, it looks like someone went through and shaped all, snapped all these in half, not lightning. But that can't be possible. <clears throat> can't believe my eyes. Just look at this flint. These huge trees are snapped right in two. Jeez. Those pig looking thingums just like snapped everything around here. How could such big trees get ripped down like this? There's only one thing for sure. Whatever did this wasn't human. And no, it wasn't me. What do we do now? They had the path completely blocked. Actually, Hinawa and the kids might be stuck out there. Because of all these knocked down trees blocking the way. Even if it's not the most direct path. We should look for another way around. It's probably best we split up into a few groups. Oh, look at that guy's huge face. Hey! We found Hinnom and the kids? Lighter? Are you sure you're in good enough shape to be out here? I'm always in good enough shape. Don't treat me like I'm some injured clod. We'll take care of things here. Keep pushing ahead, Flint. Or we can just like... Alright. 
Let's get going. I guess this is a good stopping point right here. Save your game. Yep. Alright, thanks guys for watching. We'll continue this off in the next episode. See you guys.